My name is Kalen Garner. I'm from North Carolina originally. Uh, moved to Nashville 12 years ago to chase the crazy dream of being a country singer. I listened to music and I was going, man, I really wish I could do that. So I just started learning, playing with records. And then as I started learning to sing, I started wanting to go, I wish I could write a song like that. So I just started studying. So I wrote this song, it's called Back Home. And for me, it's everything that you remember or an old truck you drive from high school that takes you back home. Working with Mark Bright was a dream come true. I felt so humbled and just so thankful that somebody like him believed in little old me from Coleridge, Ridge, North Carolina. <laughs> It was a big moment in my life. NBC's The Voice was another dream come true. It was getting to work with Blake Shelton. I've always loved his music, so I'll never forget that moment. Seeing my mom and daddy's reaction, man, it, it absolutely broke my heart, man. It was just the most humbling thing I've ever experienced. Just to see the, the happiness on their faces, man, it was more of a gift for me than I could have ever asked for. My truck is old blue. My daddy bought brand new in 88. He just never got rid of it. And that was my first ride in high school. My baby sister and my mom always all crammed into that little single cab. So that's, that's my version of back home. When we started talking about the music video, I was like, they were showing me different trucks. And I said, you know what? How about I get my old blue back? <laughs> and we put it in the music video. And they're like, who's old blue? I went home, let mama start driving my car I had, and I got old blue back, and man, I love it. I called my daddy first, and I was like, daddy, Rough Country's wanting to work with me. He's like, hot dog, that's awesome, son. I was like, yeah, but he was like, what, what you gonna do to the truck? I was like, they wanna lift it, how big? <laughs> I was like, well, they don't wanna go real big. They wanna do like four inches. He was like, that won't be too bad. And then I called him back, like a, maybe a week later after talking to you, I was like, daddy, don't hate me, but I'm six foot six, and I love you and mama for putting them step rails on that truck, but I have never used them. And if it's my truck and you give it to me, I gotta go, I gotta go big or go home. And so yeah, I was like six inches on 35s. That's, that's the look, you know? Man, I, I don't even know what to think right now. That's my baby, and like, you know, everybody wants, you know, bigger wheels and tires and, and a lift kit, I feel like. That's just, that's the country boy's dream right there. So I'm freaking out excited. I, I'm, I'm extremely humbled and thankful. I can't wait for this first one to come out because it's, every time I listen to it, I feel like if 16-year-old me could hear that, I'll probably just never quit dancing and smiling.